Hi everyone, uh, my name is Harik Lelaba, I'm an aerothermodynamicist. Hi everyone, my name is Jenny Oakham, I'm an operations performance engineer. So what is your role here at Sauber and what do you do on a day-to-day -day basis? Right now I work in the aerodynamics department. That means that we are trying to put performance in the car. What we do is that we focus on a very specific part of the car and we try to sort of specialize on that. We try to make very, very small changes that are going to improve the aerodynamics or how the flow behaves around the car. And how about you? For me, I have a range of projects across engineering and operations. And basically our department is looking at how we can continually improve the processes that we do across the team. It's quite important at the moment with the current change in the Formula One rules. The Formula One business model has had to change. We need to make sure that we use our resources in the best way and operate in a sustainable manner. So in the end, to bring more performance to what we do in our day-to-day -day jobs and eventually to the race car. How do you use technology in your role? We rely on it more and more to be able to get better and better results. Apart from the CFD or the computational side of my job, we also have experiments and all the different processes that we are using there. And how about you? In my day-to-day -day business, I'm using my Acer laptop to attend meetings and to present presentations or to use different softwares to analyse our processes. And of course, I also rely on the people that are competent in their role. So for example, you in aerodynamics, you're using a lot of different technologies. Yeah, I suppose it's part of your role, right? You have to assess the technologies that we're using. Exactly, to make sure that they're the right technologies or which technologies we should use more. So what advice would you give to other young students on how to come into Formula One? The main thing that I would like to stretch is that it doesn't matter where you're from, what your language is, where you were born. If you really want to do something and you work hard, then eventually you're going to make it. The sky's the limit. Yeah, I completely agree. It's important to believe in your dreams, to keep working hard and be resilient. And if you really, really want something, then you will get it. That was a very interesting conversation. Thanks guys for joining. I hope that we managed to answer most of your questions and we'll see you soon.